guys, welcome back to today's video. Today is Father's Day. I told you in a previous video that what Sam wants to do for Father's Day is very different than what I want to do. So we're gonna do what he wants to do. Sam usually does chores every Saturday and Sunday. And today I took care of chores so that he could sleep in. I think that's the first time that's ever happened. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to say. say that Sam likes to get up in the morning he's always up early and he and he just goes and does chores and then I take care of stuff in the house so but today he got to rest did you get to sleep in Sam yeah now we're headed to get coffee the phone is ringing and I bet you it's Sophie Sophie Sam always buys us coffee on the weekend so we're gonna buy him coffee today all right yeah, all the things for Sam. All the things for you, Sam. So today Sam said that he didn't really want to do anything. He just wanted to relax and do his own thing. It turns out, it turns out that what Sam wants to do is the same stuff that I like doing. He is still working on getting this area all cleaned out. Yeah. I know. So he wants us for Father's Day to come out here and pick up all these rocks. No, he never said that. Yes, he did. Yeah, he did. Yeah, we'll pick up all those rocks. We'll do that for you. You're worth it. What are you doing to the fire pit area? Cleaning up the mess that somebody likes to keep. Here. Yeah, my son comes and cuts wood and then it gets to be like a bit messy over here. More rocks here for us to pick up. It doesn't look like much, but this is the little pile that my son's been cutting so that we have wood for the summer. But then he leaves the poles everywhere, so it's hard for Sam to cut the grass. Happy Father's Day, Sam. <laughs> <You know. laughs> yeah. We're trying to like get all the, all the rocks out. It doesn't like this. Ruby. That was a big burp. So let's show them. All right, let's show them what happens when you wait too long to pick rocks out of the field. So Sophie's been attacked by burrs. Maybe you guys call them something different in your country. But we call them burrs. And they're prickly things that stick to you. Turn around, let's see the back. Aww. Look at her feet. <laughs> Look at her butt. <laughs> oh my gosh. And you may think that it's just Sophie. But it's not. Can you cut them all off? <laughs> yeah. Because it's, it's bad. <laughs> Seems easy. But some of these rocks are like way in the ground. So I use this tool that I found, this metal thing, to dig them out. I'm not gonna lie, 
This is not the most fun I've ever had on a Sunday. Gabby's using an old fashioned stick to dig her rocks out. Then there are the rocks that look really tiny and then you pull on it and it's like way bigger than you thought it was gonna be. It's been 10 minutes and Gabby is still working on the same rock. That's what rock picking is like. All of our friends are at horse shows and we're so jealous. No, not really, it's hot. Yeah, it is hot, but it's only gonna be hotter when our shows start. All right, so we, <laughs> we dug out a lot of rocks. The problem is gonna be anybody walking down here is going to be subject to broken ankle syndrome. Your ankles won't break that easily when you're young. Well, they can go and it will just hurt for a couple of seconds and then you get back up. Yeah, that's what My happens to me. My ankles always hurt. Yeah, we did good. We did pretty good. You know how many rocks I cleared? How many rocks did you clear? 15. Really? Yeah. Really? Uh, I cleared yeah. 46. I cleared a lot too. No, I, <laughs> I cleared 46. Gabby, I cleared 100. How's your Father's Day happening? Great. This is great. No chores. Just get to watch you guys do chores. All right, there's a skunk somewhere here, you guys. And it is very, very strong. Oh my God. <laughs> you go first. <laughs> you go first. Oh no. There's literally a skunk somewhere. We can smell it so bad. If we get sprayed by a skunk, this will be the worst Father's Day ever. Oh my gosh. Oh no, I smell fire. It is dinner time for the mares. I got a little bit dirty today. Why is it so dirty? Oh, and up there too. Yeah, I know. Well, what happened was it dropped on the ground. So by the end of this, so it's been really cold today. By the end of this week, it's supposed to be really hot again. Super fun. Hi, Pen. So I do want to take a moment and just say how grateful we all are to look at Gracie. She's like, I want that. <laughs> how grateful. I want to say how grateful we are to have Sam and we want to recognize all that he does for us and all the horse shows he drives us to, all the help by doing all the chores on weekends so that we can sleep in and so much more behind the scenes stuff that you guys don't even ever see. We're so grateful for him. I'm hurry up before Gary turns his tent on. Tomorrow we are back to a regular routine. We'll be with the boys. We actually have an appointment with our saddle fitter, which is so super exciting. Yeah, Plus, I'm gonna show you guys what I got for Chance and Sophie. Mm. And I'm really excited to try that and see if it makes a difference for them. We're really struggling with trying to figure out a saddle for him and for her. So hopefully tomorrow and we'll make, him. yeah, for both of you. Hopefully tomorrow will make a big huge change in their riding journey. Don't you know that you're beautiful? Just the way you are. Just the way you came. Don't you know that you're beautiful? Don't you know that you're